Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if the email app is not working properly on your Windows 10 device. So this could certainly be a frustrating issue, and in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve it without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start off by opening up the Start menu, type in Settings, Best Match should come back with Settings listed right above App. So go ahead and left click on that. Go and select the Apps tile. Select Apps and Features on the left side. And then in search this list, you want to type in Mail. And one of the best matches should come back with Mail and Calendar. Go ahead and left click on that. Select the Advanced Options link. And then you want to scroll down to where it says Reset. If this app isn't working right, reset it. This app's data will be deleted. If you left click on reset, it says this will permanently delete the app's data on this device, including your preferences and signed in details. Go ahead and left click on reset. Now attempt to open up the mail and calendar app and see if that has resolved your problem. If you are still experiencing a problem, just make sure you back everything up, you know, obviously before you really jump too deep into this tutorial, but the next thing you can try would be to actually uninstall the app. So uninstalling the app and its settings, your documents will not be affected. Select the uninstall option. It says this app and its related info will be uninstalled. Go ahead and select uninstall. And just give it a moment here. We'll take a couple moments to uninstall the app. Okay, so once that is uninstalled, if you just try and search the list again and type in mail, you notice it's no longer there. So now we're going to go ahead and install the app. So go open up the star menu, type in CMD. Best match should come back with command prompt. You want to right click on that and then select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. Now, I'm going to have a command in the description of my video. I want you guys to copy it. It starts with D-I-S-M. So copy that and then go up to the top bar of the command prompt here. Right click on it. Left click on edit and then left click on paste to paste it in. And you can see it was actually pretty quick. Completed successfully. So we close it here. Okay, so once you've run that command, now you also want to go open up the star menu again. Type in Windows Store. Open up Windows Store, Microsoft Store, they call it different things. And into the search field up at the top, you want to select that and type in Mail and Calendar. It should be from the Microsoft Corporation. Select the Get button. You can sign in with Microsoft account. I'm just going to select no thanks just to keep this tutorial moving a little bit. And if you give it a moment here, it's going to begin the download process. And once it says completed, you can actually go ahead and launch the Mail and Calendar app, and that should be about it. And if you're still, for some reason, missing any of your Mail app packages, you can attempt to run that command that we just did a little while ago, and that should be about it. So, pretty straightforward process here, guys. I do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.